The U.S. State Department encourages Canada and Saudi Arabia to work out their dispute to avoid damage. Clarence Shaughnessy reports. The U.S. State Department urged Canada and Saudi Arabia to resolve their dispute triggered by Canadian comments expressing concern over the arrests of activists in the Arab state. Uh, both sides need to diplomatically resolve this uh, together. We can't do it for them. They need to resolve it together. Canada plans to seek help from United Arab Emirates and Britain to defuse an escalating diplomatic dispute with Saudi Arabia, as traders revealed that Arab state would no longer buy Canadian wheat and barley. The Saudi government on Sunday recalled its ambassador to Ottawa, barred Canada's ambassador to Riyadh, and placed a ban on new trade, denouncing Canada for urging the release of rights activists. Riyadh accused Ottawa on Tuesday of interfering in its internal affairs. But we would encourage both governments to work out their issues together. It's a diplomatic issue. Saudi Arabia and Canada can certainly stand to work it out together. A source said the Liberal government of Prime Minister Justin Trudeau planned to reach out to the United Arab Emirates. Another source said Canada would also seek help from Britain. The British government on Tuesday urged Canada and Saudi Arabia to show restraint. The Office of Foreign Minister Christia Freeland did not respond to requests for comment. The dispute looks set to damage what is a modest bilateral trade relationship worth nearly $4 billion a year. Canadian exports to Saudi Arabia totaled about $1.12 billion in 2017, or 0.2% of the total value of Canadian exports. Much of that were tanks, armored personal carriers, and motor vehicles. Clarence Shaughnessy, UNTV News and Rescue, New York, USA.